everyone. Today I am sharing one of my very favorite productivity hacks, and that is how I import hundreds of Outlook meeting invites at once. Recently, I did 136 invites in just 13.63 seconds. So if you are scheduling a lot of meetings and you need to upload a conference schedule or you're planning a yearly calendar, then this video is just for you. If that's what you're interested in, then just keep watching. Okay, everyone, so here's an overview of my spreadsheet that I use to import all of these meetings into Outlook. This saves a ton of time, especially when you have set this up once. Typically, as an EA, you're gonna be importing this information again and again. So having this, taking the time to set up appropriately the first time you can reutilize a lot of the same meetings will happen. Um, the other benefit to this is that you can post it in a collaborative space, so on your SharePoint or OneDrive, and allow other people to add their information so you are managing the process and not managing the content. Um, not that you can't do both, but hopefully you won't have to do both. <laughs> Um, okay, so just a quick overview. I have categories here. These are my categories that are set up. Let me just show them to you. They are set up exactly as they are in Outlook. I also have my show as just in Outlook. Um, just because when I originally did this, I had, I don't know, close to 400. So it's just easy for me to just click on the drop down list. Um, as well as if I clear this. These are all my categories so that when I'm going through, I can very quickly just pick them and move on. It's very, very fast. Um, the one other thing that I think is, is really beneficial is I actually use this little tool right here so that if I'm clicking and I need to obviously pick a lot of dates rather than type in the dates, I can just click over, click the date, and it inserts it just like that. So very easy. Um, okay. Okay, guys, so what we're gonna do here, this is what the calendar is going to look like. I'm actually going to create a new one. So I'm gonna go right click on my calendar, click on new calendar. I'm gonna say EA import example and click okay. And then I'm actually gonna click on that one. So if you notice, this is completely blank. There is nothing on here. So when I import, you're gonna see a lot of meetings show up. So let's go ahead and get that started. So what we're gonna do is go to File, Open and Export, and then Import and Export, and then Import from another program or file and hit Next, and then the comma separated values and hit Next. It's going to ask you to go find it. I have mine on my desktop. And then hit next. Sorry, let me go back. Actually, this is going to ask you if you want to allow duplicates. Um, this is a blank one, so I'm fine to allow duplicates. There's nothing on here. It's going to ask you to find the calendar. Mine is already open, but if not, you would go find it and hit next. My Excel file is mapped exactly, so I don't need to map my custom fields. If you've created something different or you're not using this template, then uh, you would need to map your custom fields and then hit finish. So when I hit finish, I want you to take a look at the calendar and notice all the meetings that are going to get imported. Ready? Alrighty, so here it is. If I go through, um, all this information is automatically added. I did not have to go through there and add all of it. So this is a really fabulous tool for you to use when you are building out calendars or if you are um, building out a conference schedule so you don't have to individually click and create hundreds of separate emails. So I hope that this was really helpful to you guys. I'd love to hear your feedback. If you have any questions, please give me a shout out and I would be happy to answer anything that I can. Thanks everyone and have a great day.